Saturday night, I was sitting in a tent up near Fletcher Peak in Yosemite Park, and it was hailing. I was wet. I was inside a tent. Uh, and I just, this, this debate came to my mind that I've heard a lot about, um, but never really talked openly about, which is this debate in the carbon removal community around nature versus technology. There's this debate whether nature-based solutions are better than technology-based solutions or whether technology solutions are better than nature-based ones. I've got my own opinion on this that's, that's forming, but to me, it's something for us to, to talk about and work out. So if it's something that, that you've thought a lot about and you've got some ideas that you'd like to share, I'd love to hear about it. It seems like something maybe we could have a, um, a Zoom discussion on. So if you're interested in that, just hit reply and say, I'd, I'd love to have a discussion about nature, technology. How do we think about these different uh, approaches? Uh, and, and how can we make more progress on pulling carbon from the air? So once I emerged from the woods, I came back to these hallway meetings today. Uh, I had back-to-back 10-minute -back little meetings, and it worked really well. Uh, it was really nice to have these quick meetings with some people, some people who are friends who I haven't seen in a long time. Some people are new faces who I had never met. Uh, some people I was just, just catching up with. It worked really well. Uh, I was able to help people get connected to ideas in, in direct air capture or ideas in or people in investment. Um, and so I'm going to try it again. So a, a lot of people had signed up, but the, the slots had all filled up. So uh, I heard that, that some people weren't able to, to sign up. So I'm going to try this again next week. Uh, you can click the link here and, and sign up for the, the sessions next week. Everybody who tried this seemed to like it. So I recommend that you try it. If you can set up uh, uh, Calendly, helps a lot with you can schedule these 10 minute meetings because um, you can just you can book them back to back and just give yourself half an hour and say, hey, I'm going to do these 10 minute meetings or whatever. You can fit them into your schedule. It is a it's a big relief because if there's somebody you want to talk to, but you end up spending half an hour or an hour with them and it just doesn't really feel like a good use of time. Uh, just set up as a set up as a ten minute one, and, and you can follow up later if you need to. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try it again this coming week. Give it a shot, and uh, yeah, try it yourself. 